Hi, my name is Tandwe Horoche. I play Tandasa on The Brave Ones, and you're watching the Nganao Live YouTube channel. Hi, my name is Pierre Locotelo. I play well on The Brave Ones, Netflix, and you're watching Nganao Youth Channel. Feel so good. Oh my God, it feels so good. Feel so good. Oh my God, it feels so good. Feel so good when you treat me like no other, no other. Feel so good when you call me your lover, your lover. Feel so good, one lucky brother, lucky brother. It feels so good, oh yeah, it feels so good. Thank you so much for having us, first of all. Kamala Mwana from the Kanawe Live YouTube channel. This is Ayanga, the producer of the Kanawe Live YouTube channel. Um, we are very honored to be here. So this is your second production you taking it away with the Netflix this collision. Now since we learn we brave one. How is the experience different between the two? Um the different is the storyline. Um yes, it's it's for Netflix, but the difference it's a storyline. I would just have to put it that way and mm -hmm. stop that. It's a storyline. <laughs> <laughs> and what is it that you, you say when you really appreciate? And it drew you to the storylines of the people and, and the character. Look, um, you know, this character resonates with me because I'm I'm a very humble someone and now and a loving father and a husband to my beautiful <laughs> woman. So um, and Ubaba say next door um that you can shana na bantu ahlale nabo and everything so uh, it, it was the story it's it's truth to who i am there and there Mm. We a little bit told us what you love doing research. Yeah. So we just wanted to find out what, yeah. sure. what lengths did you go to mm. to fully understand the story and what it is about and how you can better portray the role that you're playing. And just to get that connection with the story, what do you think I think for me what one, yes, you're hundred percent correct. I love research. My background is in dra dramatic arts and uh, methodology and research in sociology. So I've, I've always loved to just go deeper on, you know, on any subject. I don't just take anything at face value. And I think the drama training as well teaches us that you'll That's be true. faced with like five or ten um, characters that are sort of similar. But people have to see something different. They can't see me and the brave ones and say, oh, but I literally every single thing she did there, she just did on this one. So they need to. And that's where research comes in. Who is Tanda Zagasa? What is the, her environment? How? What is her relationship with these children? Um, is this, yes, this one might not be, without giving the story away, might not be her biological child. What does that mean, you know, in terms of family uh, dynamics? And that was the research I did. And I think, I hope I try to portray her as a very stern woman who's conflicted because of this child that's not hers who she probably doesn't really even understand <laughs> where this child comes from um, in the greater scheme of the of, of the story. And um, and I hope I try to uh, reflect that because based on my research of who that character is and what that world is. I might not know it 100% in terms of that life, but I can definitely relate to it. One, as a mother, like Pierre said, as a father, he relates to it as a husband, he relates to it. I'm a, I'm a wife as well, I've got three, uh, three children. So I think you always draw a bit as well. You take a bit of yourself and you portray it and you just add the element of storytelling, obviously. And you know, you, you mentioned mm -hmm. uh, you don't want you want to do another thing with this production. I'm going to do a huge rewind right okay. now. Okay, oh lord. Early 2000s. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Mm. yes. When you were just born. Yes. Mm. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Very amazing. Mm. I hope I can. Yeah. I day. had twins. I wow. Thought, I thought Thank you. Yeah. So this day, yeah. I still have to remind myself. Yeah. Yeah. Only you were good, huh? Thank you. Man. And Thank I you, mean, my also that speaks to a lot. It speaks to your talent and mm. it speaks to filmmaking and um, techniques in general. How have would you say um, since then until now you've been in the brain? What what are the things you've 
have seen to implement the change. Thank you. Thank you for that question and thank you for what you just said about the characters or legends in Z or the characters that I played. Um, I think one, I've evolved as well as a storyteller and what I see in, in the industry is there's a lot of uh, authentic storytelling that's happening now. And I'm so proud, especially about the Brave Ones and Netflix, such a platform, a big platform like Netflix to say, okay, we want to hear just those authentic African stories. And what does that say to anyone at home is like, oh, so just a normal story that I grew up on and my like fireside stories that I know from my grandmother or my grandfather or anyone. So I can eventually see them on screen. Yes, you can, because that is what's happening. So I think we come from a time in, in TV industry where, you know, everything was still quite slow. It would happen in that little corner and happened in that little corner. Now this, that's why I think everyone's bringing the A game in terms of saying, okay, what do I have in my little kitty of, of stories? And I see a lot of growth and I see a lot of pride in, in terms of people just saying, oh, I'm just going to tell my normal story of being Zulu, Tswana, Tsonga, or, you know, or, you know, whoever I am, and I'm going to bring it onto an international platform like this. And just to wrap up, mm. you mentioned something mm. that um, the story was speaking to you as a person. So now that you've portrayed the character that you're portraying, both of you actually, yeah. what's one thing that you'd love for all of us as all, the audience to take away from the story? So it doesn't have to be long. Look, <laughs> look um, the story, um, this is what we have to take. You are um, Umdana Sekasi. Yeah. Now, Mdana Sekasi, uh, looking and at the at the Kasi story. Yeah. You can see it was not lavish where we find out the uh, Gugupi, mm. Kuse, or Tino Gugupi, but some cooking, but there is life. Yeah. People are so proud of what they 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 wanna be. Ikasi. That's one. Secondly, it was done by Stella yeah. Black, <laughs> owned. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, mm. a movie or a series, and not only that, by Netflix, eh? yeah, and <laughs> with Stella Karst and the production. Yeah. So, I'm telling you, when you're watching it, we want you to relate. Yeah. Because we have also some super natural powers. Everything he said. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you.